The Secretary General is leading by example through his strategy for gender parity. Uh, therefore, in UNOWAS, we have made a conscious effort in our recruitment policy to ensure that we scale up and uh, seek to achieve gender parity. I am personally very proud that in my senior uh, management team, uh, I can proudly say that we have achieved uh, gender parity. I'm happy to have a deputy who is female, a chief of staff who is female, and my chief of admin and finance also, who is uh, a female. So uh, when we in-house in are able to raise the levels as we have done, uh, achieving nearly 42% gender parity in UNOWAS, it strengthens us in our advocacy of gender parity in member states. The reasons for gender parity and uh, ensuring that member states uh, eliminate all forms of discrimination against uh, women is uh, because uh, in most countries in our region, women constitute more than 50% of the population. If we uh, ignore uh, as much as half of the population in any country, then indeed, we are not taking advantage, we are not ha harnessing the true human resource, which is the basis of uh, transformation in any society. The other reason is that there are just so many barriers uh, to empowerment of women that we need to advocate uh, strongly to have these removed so that uh, in, in West Africa and the Sahel, women play their rightful role uh, in contributing to the development of their societies.